Hey everybody, it's uh, Ken Lambeau back today. Uh, Want to go ahead and talk about a few things on this video. One, why I believe it's a good time to buy. Two, um, why you should hold. And three, some of the updates that came out. Uh, also want to tell you how I found Kick. A little bit of a sad story. And uh, why I believe in the product. Uh, there's been a lot of hate on there uh, on Reddit and some of the people in the video. Um, these examples I'm using are examples for the real world, okay? How people think, um, you know, everything's, you know, just simple examples, right? They're not me saying, oh, the coin's going to hit a cent, it's going to hit five cents, it's going to hit 25 cents, a dollar. No, I am simply putting numbers out there and calculating things, saying this is potential, right? So for all you guys screaming about, how the price will never reach that and you know this is unrealistic yeah okay it might be we don't know we don't know what the future holds but what i can tell you is i'll go over some of the updates uh some of the things uh that i read on and the key points that i hit on today and why i believe in the product so how did i find ken let's let's talk about that uh ken uh i found late at night okay i had gone through a breakup and I had moved out and I said, well, I could either go out and get really drunk and chase a bunch of women and do what I used to do uh, when I got out of the army. And, or I could go do something constructive, stay sober and uh, find something to invest in. So I'm searching the web, searching the web, and I come across crypto sites and I see this ad for Ken. I said, well, let me read on it. So I start reading on it and I read the white paper and then I do a little bit more Googling and I see, oh, it's, it's by Kick. All right, well, that's that's pretty neat. Do some uh, looking up of Kick's information and how they're doing and their, you know, their user base. And I said, well, based off of what I can see, because I've, I've scrolled through so many coins and looked, I said, I think this is a good investment. So I threw some money into it and uh, got registered for the ICO first. Uh, Got notified when that was coming out when I could purchase. I purchased, and uh, here we are, you know, just kind of holding on. Now, why do I think it's a good time to buy? Uh, we can look at the price right here. Uh, we're at three Satoshis. Uh, we're, you know, things, the market's down right now. Bitcoin's down. Pretty much everything is uh, kind of in the dumps. So you have a good price to buy, and you can hold. And I'm going to go over why it's going to be important for you to hold with all these updates that are kind of coming out. And I'm going to hit, like I said, on these key points uh, that they've come out with in their articles uh, and explained, you know, some of the new developments and, and new things with the ecosystem that, that I think are going to be big. And, uh, you know, I, and it's the reason I hold, it's the reason I have faith in the product, it's the reason I believe, because I don't think anyone else is going to do it this way. At least I haven't seen it yet. So, you know, let's look at some of these articles, right? Uh, talking about the product division, right? Um, what's key about this article? What's really key about it? Uh, I read into it this way. This is what the main thing I would be excited about if I were holding Kin. This is, makes me want to hold longer. Um, they're saying, hey, you know, we're working on our MVP to be announced Q1. You know, to be integrated into Kick and Ken. Uh, so what does that mean for you? That means whatever that MVP is, it might be big. We don't know yet. It could be a small provider. It could be something uh, massive. You know, some used service that, um, you know, let's say, I don't know, Starbucks or Netflix or, you know, it could be some type of peer-to-peer uh, -peer payment processing. It, the, the opportunities are endless. And and this article goes over the, the monetization system that they're trying to develop, right? And it's still in development. And that's another main reason that you want to hold, right? We have uh, so many different things that are available. And it goes on to explain that they're making these things easy, right? They're five-minute STK, uh, you know, things that are easy to, to make in the marketplace. Uh, you can roll out quickly as a partner. Uh, it's not going to be complicated, right? And, and, you know, a lot of people are complaining, oh, what about the price and, and, and the market cap? And 
you scroll, scroll down here, we'll look and say, and you can see what they say here. It says the value of kin that they hold increases as usage and demand grows over time. Okay, so what does that tell you? Think about it. So it goes on to kind of tell you what they're building out of a box turnkey solution. Okay, a turnkey solution that I can pop out of the box, say, okay, here, Mr. Developer, plug your application into that. Here's the capabilities it has. Um, you don't got to be a kin expert, and uh, you can make your app start interacting with kin, and people can earn off a of kin and uh, spend kin. And there's, I think that's going to be big as well, right? And they have a plan. Right. This, these are the big things that 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 you should that that should make you want to hold. So you you're getting it low right now. While the market's down, you know you want to pick it up. Right. Pick it up while it's lower, uh, lower in price. Um, you know. And, and to everyone out there that says, hey, you're shilling, you're shilling, you're shilling. Okay. I'm just saying I'm giving you my advice. This is not professional financial advice. This is just my professional, not my professional. I'm sorry, my personal opinion on what I would do while the price is where it's at, okay? And with all the updates coming out, um, we don't know where this is gonna go, right? We don't know what's in the future, but um, there's a lot that they're talking, they're discussing, you know, that they're going over in in these articles, right? And, uh, you know, it's kind of giving you some examples here, and we've got a video of, of someone earning some can and, and spending it on a gift card right in the marketplace so um you know it goes through that and basically shows you how it purchases a gift card using ken so that's completely uh plausible and it, it can happen right they they they're kind of displaying that capability so you know as things move forward we'll see more and more come out and that's when it's going to get exciting uh if you don't hold right and you have uh trading add uh you might miss that one big run-up right you might miss that big product release um ken is a longer term hold in my opinion but why is it a longer term hold because they are like i said they are making this ecosystem they are making this monetization system for for it to be available to the masses for it to be available to the one, the the partners and application developers and things of that nature, right? There's lots of different ideas out there. Uh, you know, this article here discusses kin and gaming, right? Uh, there are lots of games that have, you know, where you can buy uh, currency in game and and uh, do some micro processing with it, uh, micro transaction processing, and um, you know, just think about it. If Kin were to be integrated to a lot of those different applications, right? Uh, instead of buying the little gold coins in the game, you buy Kin, right? And not only can it be used uh, in the game, it can be used across multiple platforms. Um, you know, there, there. I think there's a lot of opportunity there uh, for Kin to be use like i said use cases right this is what i've said in my video and and why i invest in stuff it is the use cases are there there's so many use cases for kin there's so many uh things that are coming out that are going to make it easy the the ios sdks the marketplace the ecosystems the, you know their their idea for the five minute S, uh, out of box sdk right and like i said if we if you haven't heard that turnkey solution uh terminology before uh, in technology, they, uh, some of the, you know, technology I work with is, you know, out of a box turnkey solution is uh, you're unpacking it, plugging it in, do a little configuration, and you're ready to go, all right? That's your turnkey solution, and that is easy to use, all right? Uh, I, I used to, I sell technology at times, and uh, I will go in and I'll say, okay, hey, uh, looks like you guys need these capabilities, and this turnkey solution will meet x y and z right um, it'll protect your data it'll uh, give you the storage you need and the application capabilities right and all you gotta do is plug it in give it an ip address uh, do a little bit of configuration and away you do away you go so that's kind of where they're getting at with ken 
Um, so I really believe, you know, I thoroughly believe that, you know, as these developments and as these uh, new capabilities come out, it's going to be something that's going to kind of revolutionize, like I said, and I, I believe will revolutionize uh, cryptocurrency, right? This is something different. Uh, no one else is really doing this to the level that they're doing it. They're, they're, they're making it easy. They're working on partnerships. They're not rushing to, to market, okay? That is what is why really I, I, I am thinking that once they start releasing these things, and people get a hold of what's going on, they're going to be rushing for the for the token, for the coin, for Ken. I mean, I have myself, I'm still picking some up as we go, slowly but surely. A couple hundred bucks here, a thousand bucks there. Um, I am stacking up and I'm doing a couple other investments. Um, Origin Trail one, that was uh, one of my other picks because that was, you know, backed by Walmart. Walmart, they did a competition and, and Walmart, uh, you know, gave funding to the ones that, you know, that won that competition. Uh, and it seems to be a great product that it's got a good use case and it has some funding from a large company. So uh, I went and I invested in that, uh, doubled my money, put it back in the can. Uh, so I'm still kind of dabbling out there. haven't found, you know, what's next. Uh, so I'm not going to really go into that with these videos. I, I am really here to advocate for Ken. I think that if you look at everything, if you read these articles, and like I said, pay attention to, to the important parts of it, right? Um, and, and, and these are your, your, your key highlights that, that really should clue you in to, the, to, to how big this may be, right? We're going we're gonna to work on our MVP, right? The end of Q1. So Q1, something's coming. Right. You don't have to wait that long. We don't have to sit here and 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 whine and cry that that Ken's not going up when we know we have an announcement coming Q1 and we're going to find out who their MVP is. Right. And we know that hopefully there's going to be this five minute SDK coming out that everyone's going to be talking about. I don't know. Um, you know, it could suck terribly. But chances are it's going to be halfway decent because they've got a pretty decent development team uh, from what I've seen and the research I've done. So, you know, summarize everything, guys, and ladies and gentlemen. You want to get some kin now. Dark market's down. Prices are low. Uh, hold on to it. You know, to really, I think, really you, to, to see some realistic movement on it, you'll have to wait till the end of Q1. It's not too far away. And, uh, you know, pick it up as, as you go, right? If you don't have enough to invest a thousand, two thousand, three thousand, just pick a couple hundred up. That's all you have to do, right? The price of it is at the point to where you get hundreds of thousands of kin for a couple hundred bucks. So, uh, you know, get it, hold on to it, make sure you keep it in a secure place. Um, you know, I've got all these people on Reddit saying, oh, you put your wallet out there. You put this information. Here's your private key. Here's your public key. Cool, bro. I, I get it. I mean, listen, I used a new account from MetaMask, which I will never use again. Uh, and I will always create something new for these videos. Uh, I mean, if you want to go trace where my wallet address is, you know, have at it. Uh, people are like, you're not a smart man. Okay, I'm not a smart man, guys. There's always someone out there smarter. Um, it doesn't bother me. It doesn't hurt my feelings. Uh, I'm here to advocate for Ken. I'm here because I believe in the product. I think it's going places. And I'm not going to sit here and, you know, throw fluff out there and, and shill this coin all the time. I, I'm actually giving you my honest opinions. Uh, and not everyone's going to agree with me okay that's just the way it is and people are going to beat you over the head with their opinions and there are a lot smarter people when it comes to cryptocurrency and no i'm not the smartest guy when it comes to crypto i'm just using uh you know my my logic whatever jacked up logic that may be and i am giving you my what i think is a good, you know my honest opinion 
for and not what I think. What I know is my honest opinion. I, I'm giving you my insight based off of my research and my technical background. Okay, uh, I come from an infrastructure uh, background, so servers, storage, data protection, disaster recovery, security, um, and I'm getting now into the crypto world. Right, um, so. As I progress through the crypto world and I, I learn more and I pick up that information, I'm still not a financial genius. Uh, working on my financial prowess, but, you know, that'll take some time. So you guys can continue on with the hate. Uh, anyone that has, uh, you know, their opinions, you're more than welcome to come on a, uh, a video with me and, and share your opinion with the group. Um, and if you don't like what I had to say, you can always turn the video off, right? Um, like I said, I'm not the I'm not the crypto expert. This is cryptos for the rest of us, okay? This is my my simple opinions. Uh, you know, I've been called many things. I think I was called a dullard. Um, it's it's just comical to me. So, you guys uh, keep on keeping on. Do what you do. If you if you like the videos, you know, give me some thumbs up. If you don't. You can leave some thumbs down, leave some comments, tell me I suck. I don't care. You wouldn't be the first one. Um, you know, anything you want to add to improve my crypto knowledge, please do so. Uh, you know, I'm always good for constructive criticism. Uh, you know, I, it doesn't bother me. And I learn something new every day. Not the smartest guy in the world, never will be. There's always someone out there smarter. There's always, especially on Reddit, man, I don't know what it is, but... Those guys are just brainiacs when it comes to crypto, and they're kind of arrogant about it, but, you know, I'll let them have their, their day. Uh, but uh, maybe, maybe one of them will teach me something someday. But, uh, you know, feel free to leave your comments in, 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 you know, on the video and let me know what you might want to see next. And I will do my best to uh, fulfill that request. Uh, you can also hit me up on Twitter at Ken underscore Lambo, or you can hit up the uh, Ken community.io website, uh, which has some of the, the frequently asked questions, some of the videos up there, um, the, the Ken Wiki, uh, just some general, you know, where to find information on Ken uh, for you new folks. But uh, so my advice is pick up some Ken today, uh, hold it. You got until the end of Q1 to see what their MVP announcement is. And then you've got all these other different developments they're working on coming out. And I think 2018 is going to be a big year for them. All right, everybody, you have yourself a great night, and uh, we'll do another video tomorrow.